What's up guys and welcome back to the Happy Power Channel. In today's video, we're discussing GTA 5 glitching and where we showed you guys the brand new cheating system that Rockstar has just implied two days ago. So with that being said, let's jump straight into the video. Alrighty guys, so welcome back and in today's video, we're discussing Rockstar's new policy or actually new cheating system that actually added two days ago in GTA 5 Online. So let's jump straight into this. The very first thing I'm going to be showing you guys is of course the article that they actually posted two days ago. Now this article is actually titled, Update Targeting Cheaters in GTA Online, and let's just read through some of it. I'm not exactly sure if I'm going to read the entire thing, but I guess we'll have to find out. Okay, so let's just read through this and afterwards we're going to talk about what's going on in the cheating system, what actually targets and a variety of things. So let's jump straight into this. The very first thing it says down below, it says, As part of our ongoing commitment to combat cheating and griefing, we have recently implemented a brand new system to allow us to more efficiently detect and target any players found running mods or any cheat programs within GTA 5. As a reminder, any attempt to tamper with the behavior of GTA Online by installing programs or executing mods, scripts, or other exploits, modifying the game files, or manipulating the game while it's executing with result and disciplinary action, including, but not limited to, time in the cheater pool, bans, and potential suspension of your GTA 5 account. Please help maintain the integrity of GTA Online experiences by keeping the sessions free of modifications and exploits. Thank you to the members of GTA Online community who have been doing their part by reporting cheaters to the ban hammer address with helpful information. For details, please see how to report cheaters in GTA Online at the Rockstar support site. So there you guys have you guys have heard directly from Rockstar themselves on the newswire. Honestly, they're definitely serious about this because usually when they say something about this, about the cheaters, that they implement a new system, they actually put it on the forum instead of the actual newswire itself. So you guys definitely know that Rockstar is serious this time. We really had to like watch our asses lately. And today I was actually going to post a money glitch, but then uh, as I was actually recording the video, I had a random person actually help me out, and I completely apologize to this person, but he did in fact get banned while we were actually doing the money glitch. I don't know what happened, but while we were actually recording the video, it was one of my fans, and he's like, oh, can I be in that video? Can I help you out? And uh, just, you know, blur my name so I don't get banned and stuff like that. So I was like, hell yeah, you know, that's awesome. My fans want to help me out, so that's awesome. And we were actually recording the video, and as soon as we got done, I'm doing about three to four cars to show you guys today. Uh, what happened about 10 minutes later, he got banned for two weeks, and uh, he was extremely pissed off at me, and I apologize. I definitely did not know that was going to happen, and it, Rockstar is extremely serious about this new cheating pool and this new cheating system, where essentially you guys sell like multiple cars at a time. Essentially what it does is just Rockstar starts to watch your account, and if they see you guys keep doing like, you know, selling multiple vehicles at a time, they'll know you guys are cheating. Or if they see you have a crap load of money in your account, they'll know you're actually cheating. So honestly, you really have to watch out, you gotta watch out how much money you make, how many cars you sell at a time, how many of the same car you guys sell at a time, and a whole bunch of crazy things. So yeah guys, I had to warn you guys about this crap, my friends are getting banned, my fans are getting banned. Just don't do any more money mods, don't do any more glitches, mods, PC mods, whatever you guys are doing right now, please just stop everything. It's like the GTA 5 glitching back when we were handing out modded vehicles and everyone was getting banned, like, people were getting console banned for this crap, just for handing out vehicles. They had like a top remove at the Costco and stuff like that. And that Rockstar actually added in the Costco top list just to counter people actually modding the vehicle. So I'm not exactly sure what Rockstar has planned for the future of G10 line when it has to do with cheating and just modded vehicles and stuff like that. But what I can tell you guys is you really have to watch out lately. Rockstar is banning people left and right with this brand new cheating system. So what you guys should take from this video is simply do not do any more money mods, no more glitching, no more modded lobbies on the old gen consoles, no more PC mods, and like game breaking shit. I'm pretty sure things are okay such as like the windmill glitch and things that rocks are just simply just put in there just like you know for us to find out and stuff like that. Like you know just simple things. Not money glitching, nothing to abuse the game, nothing to affect your account in a way that is considered cheating or just like you know getting yourself ahead of players by modding your account with money and just stupid shit like that. So just stay away from the money mods, stay away from like you know mods that'll affect your account. Just have some fun with like, you know, glitches. You know, stuff like uh, wall glitches or just like, you know, car glitches. It's like easy stuff like that. Just don't do any more money mods and you guys should be golden. So, there you guys go. I warned you guys. And Rockstar has warned you guys. They warned my friends. They're getting two week bans right now. So, just watch out out there. And I just had to share this with you guys. So, have a great day. No more money glitches. No more mods and stuff like that. And just have a good time with your friends at GTA 5. Do some heist. Do some like, you know, like simple glitches like I said, like uh, find a new way to like walk on the water or like, you know, something simple like that. So have a great day guys and hope you guys enjoyed today's video. But with that said, we have come to the end of the video once again guys, but don't worry, I'll see you guys later with a more GTA 5 video. Make sure you guys go check my brand new channel for lots of exclusive content on Xbox One games. But like I said, that's all for today's video. This is my happiness. Hope you guys enjoyed. Until next time.
I'll catch you guys later. Have a good day, guys, and I'll see you later with a brand new GTA 5 video.